I wanted to do a, uh, another video with the spy dock to show you a little bit more of the configurations in order to go through and set it up for Yahoo uh, or go ahead and set it up for AOL or anything like that. So we're going to plug in the spy dock again. If it comes up as scan and fix, just continue without scanning. Um, open folder to view files. Look for the application, SP config, right click on as the administrator, click yes to allow the program and it comes up to your spy doc menu. And again, we can click install. I'm not going to do that right now because basically I just want to show you some of the uh, things on the configuration panel. So we're going to click on this. Now I've got it set up as of right now into uh, or for Yahoo. So it's going to be a little bit different setup if you saw the last video for Gmail. Uh, so here it's going to be your S SMTP server. is smtp.mail.yahoo.com. Okay, your mail address is whatever your email address is at yahoo.com. Your mail login is whatever your email address is, obviously without the at yahoo.com. Uh, your mail password, you know, whatever password that you're going to use for your, uh, for your Yahoo account. Uh, now the mail server port on this one is going to be 465, which is the same as uh, Gmail. And then make sure that you click on this use TLS. Now I'm going to pull up and show you another one real quick. And this one we looked at at the last video. Uh, but this is for your Gmail, so you're basically going to do the same thing for your Gmail. You know, uh, .gmail.com instead of, you know, mail.gmail.com. But uh, account at gmail.com, your account, your password, your server port would be 465 as well, and then use TLS. So I'm going to minimize this. I'm going to bring up another one for you. Now, this is going to show you a couple things. Now, we've had to revise uh, some of the port numbers, especially for, like, Yahoo. If you see here, it says 587. It's actually 465 now. Um, and then the use TLS is actually uh, yes instead of no on this one. But Yahoo would be um, Yahoo would be this way. AOL would be smtp.aol.com. The server port on that one would be 587. And then you don't click on the TLS on that particular one. Uh, but that'll give you kind of a rundown on some of the other uh, other ways that you can actually use this device. Um, again, Gmail and Yahoo probably are easiest two to do on either one of those. I mean, again, both accounts would be free if you wanted to create a separate account or something like that in order to do so. Um, but again, I just wanted to kind of give you a, another rundown with uh, some of the functions of the uh, of the spy doc. And again, you can have all this information sent to your mail in any increment that you want. So I mean, however often you want to be able to check the information or get the information from the computer, um, you know, you can go through and do that. Um, but check out, um, check out our YouTube for any other further updates or any other new products that are coming out.